What's up guys, welcome to IT Security Labs. And today we're going to be working on a retired hack the box challenge. This is a challenge that covers steganography, uh, which is the art of hiding information in things. In this case, information is hidden in an image. So if you go in your hack the box under challenges stego for steganography, I will be working on hackerman. So the first thing that we need to do is download this zip folder, this the zip file. Then um, you save it. Let's just use the terminal. Let's go to the downloads folder. If you're doing an ls, you're going to see that we have a uh, hackerman dot zip. If you do an unzip, hackerman dot zip. Uh, this one. You're going to see that it will ask you for a password. The password is hack the box. And sure enough, since we already have it, so we can say yes, replace that one. So we can clear. Now we now we have this uh, JPEG file here. If you open that JPEG, you're going to see that it looks like this. That's the image of Elliot from Mr. Robot. So we don't, we don't see much here. You can look around to see if Hackerman or any passwords are there. Otherwise, um, let's go back here and try to see if we can um, just use steghide to extract the file. And steghide is a tool that we use to try to see if there's any hidden information in a file. So if we do a steghide and extract, um, Take file is hackerman jpeg. It wants a password. So this is a hint that this is a password protected stake file. So we cannot do that. Since we don't have the password, we revert to another tool in the stake family called stake cracker. Make sure that you have Steg Cracker installed on your machine. If you don't, you can look up quickly how to install Steg Cracker in your Kali or whatever machine you have, and you should be able to uh, do that. So the file name is called hegaman.jpg. This one will create the, the, the file for us, and we want to use our um, text. so user rockyou.txt. So we're going to use stay cracker here to crack the password in this one. As you can see, I already did this as a practice, but if you run this command here, it's going to crack the password for you. I'm going to delete that so we can see the cracking process happen. Now let's crack it again. It's going to take a little while to crack this one using wait list. And then when it's done, I'll show you the password that we need to be able to run steg hide on that. And a steg hide, like I said, allows us to extract information that is hidden in a file. So let's give, give this one a few minutes here. As a reminder, if you haven't subscribed and you like to see hands-on cybersecurity stuff, make sure to subscribe to my channel. The community has grown to more than 10,000 people and I'm very surprised that shows that this thing is working. So please remember to subscribe if you have. Okay, now that we have um, cracked our password and the password is almost, so we should be able to now run our steg hide command again. Uh, steg hide extract. And when it asks for a password, we just enter almost. And this time we should be able to extract the message that is hidden there. So if I do that, almost. As you can see, we extracted. There was data that was embedded in this image and now it's in the file called hackerman.txt. So if we clear and do a more hackerman.txt. We get this data. This is a base 64. Right, so our text was a base 64. So we just come in here and paste it. That is base 64 decode. And we get our 
code and this is within the hack the box stuff so we'll copy that let's go back to our hack the box machine uh, as you can see you can just come in here and enter your, your code i already entered mine but um that's the key right here, right there that you see that's what we are looking for so we were able to extract a message from an image hit it out there decode base 64 use stack so if you like this type of content please make sure to subscribe and i'll be making more videos like this otherwise i will see you in the next video